नाजरीन आज मैं हूँ लाहौर में सरप्राइज सरप्राइज और आपके लिए लाई हूँ एक बहुत ही मुनफरद शो यू एस काउंसिल जनरल मिस नीना मारिया फाइट ने मुझे इन्वाइट किया है टू सेलिब्रेट द ओकेजन ऑफ क्रिसमस एट हर ओन हाउस तो मैं यहाँ आई हूँ उनसे मुलाकात होगी कुछ बातचीत होगी और फिर वो हमारे लिए कुछ बेकिंग करेंगी उनको पता है मुझे बेकिंग का कितना शौक़ है तो हमारे शो पर आज वो हमें कुछ बेकिंग करके दिखाएंगी कि क्रिसमस पर उनके यहाँ क्या क्या चीज़ें बनती हैं सो लेट्स गो एंड मीट हर Assalamualaikum. A very happy Christmas to you. Thank this you. Is something small for you. Thank you. This is beautiful. Come on in. Thank you. That is a lovely Christmas tree you have up. Well, it's not completely decorated yet. We have some lights on it, but you know, in America, family traditions are a little different from house to house, okay. and. In my house when we were growing up we waited until Christmas Eve so December 24th to decorate the tree okay. so come Monday night I'll be taking out some ornaments and putting them on the tree Okay that's a very different uh, tradition I thought it was uh, always a few days ago No it depends okay. um these days there are some people who put up a tree December 1st okay. and others who wait till maybe the week before Christmas a lot of times because American families are spread out People wait for their the family to come back, family to come yeah. back and, and it's a family activity. Okay, that's very so, nice. Uh, something new to learn. Yes. Yeah. So please come on in. Thank you. Here, let me just put these over here. So again, welcome to my house. Thank you. It's a lovely, well-decorated house, especially for Christmas. I love the flowers and the Christmas trees all around. Tell me, Nina, what do you like about the food here, or what? Is it that you're really fond of Pakistani food? Well, mujhe gajar halwa bahut pasand hai. Oh, aapko gajar halwa bahut pasand hai. Wow. That's one of the it's, few sentences I've learned already. Okay, it's a very wintry dessert. Yes, yeah, it is. Yeah. But your carrots in Pakistan are um really uh wonderful. They're different than the yeah. carrots we get in the US. Very flavorful. Yes. Yeah. So tell me about something about yourself. Uh what how long have you been with this uh with the service? Wow, I've been with the State Department for about 22 years now. Okay. So, uh, it's a long time commitment to public service mm. in the United States and um I like the the and I enjoy uh working in diplomatic missions overseas. Okay, so you've been doing a lot of traveling, I guess. Yes, very much so. Wow. So, this is your first time in this part of the world? No, it isn't. I spent a year in Afghanistan okay. and in fact during that time I actually came to Islamabad a number of times. So, I had been to Pakistan before I came here on my posting. Okay. okay. And uh, tell us something about Christmas in the US. Well, Christmas in the US, I think it's um first off, I think you want to talk about it as a holiday season because the US is a country that's really it's a melting pot. We have lots mm. of different people of ethnic heritage and lots of religions that come with that. So around December, January time you have um you have Hanukkah for our Jewish colleagues and friends. We have Christmas for the Christians and you know within Christianity there's so much diversity okay. between let's say Roman Catholics and Presbyterians and Lutherans and so again you have a lot of diversity in how people um celebrate. And then um you have Kwanzaa which is an African American celebration at the sa around the same time. And then you go into New Year's where then um we have the Chinese New Year and so it's a it's a real melting pot and a, a wonderful opportunity to see a lot of people celebrating their different holidays. Okay, and lo lots of different families have different uh, ways of celebrating a single uh, you know tr tradition as well like you told us about your christmas tree mm -hmm. so uh is that also to do with baking and cooking as well do you have different recipes i think so i think people do um and i for example i have a one of my dearest friends that i grew up with she her family is from um italy okay. and so every year on christmas eve they have what they call the seven um courses of fish dinner mm -hmm. and so this is um as i understand it a very italian thing to do and and i think you know then you'll see on christmas day or, or some people celebrate and have the big family get together on christmas eve or at midnight mm -hmm. and so that all depends i think on whatever your heritage is okay okay tell us something about your family do you have your family uh, all back in the states 
I do, and um, something that I think Pakistanis can identify with. I have um, 48 first cousins. <laughs> um, my mother and my father both came from very large families, okay. and so and my mother was from Brazil, and so I have quite a lot of cousins that are living in Brazil, and then my American cousins live in different parts of the U.S. Okay. And then I have a, a brother and a sister as well. Okay. So I believe you like, decorate your houses and malls and everything very well uh, during Christmas season, is that correct? I think so. I think there are some Americans who would complain that things are so commercialized that in September they're already seeing Christmas <laughs> decorations, but I think there, it, there's nothing to me it's, um, as special as uh, a snowy night with lots of little twinkling lights decorating the houses. I think that's something very special. Yeah. It does look nice uh, when the houses are decorated from outside and I believe uh, some houses even have sort of competitions that you know which is the best decorated house. <laughs> Certainly as a child that was something I would do with my parents. We would drive around or walk around the yeah. neighborhood to see which house looked the nicest and you know in certain houses in each neighborhood you would have people from all over coming to look at because they, they had um, just been so extravagant in their decorations. Gone all out to decorate yes. the houses. And a lot of it's lights, sometimes there's things like Santa Clauses, and then there are quite a number of people who will um, put perhaps a creche, um, something to show the nativity scene and, and really bring back the religious part of the ho um, holiday. And so you always have that, um, a little bit of the... the a little bit of both. Yes, yeah. exactly. Okay, I'm very excited today because you're going to cook something or bake something for me, I believe. Yes, I've got a number of things lined up for us. Okay, so I look forward to that. And Nazreen, now we're going to break a little break. We'll meet you in the kitchen. Mein.